And uh, so today I will introduce you how to set a camera or capture the image, capture a view that we want to uh, make um, some, it's like rendering a picture, but uh, for Unreal Engine, we want render, we just capture the swing short, take it, capture the swing. So now I will introduce you how to set the camera first. There are two, there are two options that the first one is that uh, you will set a camera, uh, you will create a camera and then you will need to rotate that camera or move to the uh, view that you want to export. And the second option is that uh, we will choose the view that we will choose the view first, and then we will set uh, uh, set the the view with the camera. So uh, for me, to me, uh, the second option is better and easier to action. So now I will introduce you how to uh, set a view with. <clears throat> set the view with the camera. So now, um, for example, uh, with this screen, uh, with the object, uh, with a view like this, I, I want to make a camera um, to take a, a screenshot. So I will go to uh, this symbol on the top left of the screen. We will choose. And Choose we eat camera here. There are two uh, options like camera actor and cine camera actor. And the camera actor is that uh, you will capture the screen with um, this kind of material light. But the cine camera actor is one bit more different, more interesting. So I will check, yeah, I will, um, select scenic camera actor you can see here in uh, in this box um the line and uh, the the material is so different from this one here and this is the name of that view scenic camera actor which is in the perspective for scenic camera actor yeah and now we, I want to export it. I want to take a snap of this screen. So um, to get um, a good quality uh, of the image of the view, I will increase the screen percentage this screen percentage now is 54 and if I increase to 200, you can see here, um, the quality is better, yeah. And then uh, this tab as well, where we'll pick high resolution screenshot. There will be a table appear like this. Um, this is a screenshot side multi layer, multiplier. Uh, if you want to use your view, um, to be rendered about one meter to one meter, you can, um, increase this number. Yeah, but you can see here a lot multiply may cause the rapid drive to grass. So, uh, if you're computer or laptop is powerful enough um, let's try with the number like three or four uh, and now i just um yeah there is a warning here if you uh if you choose the uh the, the, the number is too high for your compared to your the power flow of your the power of your computer. So uh I just make an example for you to see how to uh create a picture. So I just do one want here. Now you can see that the warning is 
disappear. Yeah, I would just do one. And if you want to use date and timestamp as image name, you can click here. Or if you want to name a different name, don't take. Or include buffer visualization target. And if you take to this block, there will be um two other options for you to choose. I use custom depth as mask. I just want to show you how to um take a screenshot of this uh view. So I just choose like this and then capture it means take a string sort you can see here that oh my god it disappeared that you your your image will uh will be saved at the link at the right bottom of the screen here so now I will fly the view and to show you what is the result that we made. Yeah, the image that you have just uh, take a screenshot will be in, there will be a link in here and you can um, directly select it. But if you uh, if you want um to open it later, you can go to um Unreal Engine, my project four, or uh, I save it like my project four, so uh I will save the project like this. And if you want to name a different name, to put it a different name, just uh, choose anyone you uh, want, and just choose any name that you want. Sorry. And this is my current screenshot. Will be safe here. Yeah, you see, this is the result. As you can see here, this is this is the scenic camera actor that we uh, set the camera and uh, that we already set, and then uh, we will take a screenshot of this screen, and now uh, it's here. You'll see. So that's it. That finish of uh, that's finished. Taking a screenshot. Thank you for watching.